Hey guys, greetings. Welcome to Binao TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. This is Canon Pixima TX5350. This printer is multifunctional or triple in one or multitasking if you like. You can copy, print and scan with this printer. This printer is wireless. If you check my previous video, you will see how we connected this printer to wireless network. Okay. What I'm going to show you right now is to how to scan your document. Okay. You can scan your document from this printer to your PC or from this printer to your mobile device. These days, they expect you to do this with a mobile device. And if you need to do this with your PC, you need to have USB cable. This printer doesn't come with USB cable, okay, but you can get this USB cable from Amazon.co.uk and with this USB cable, so you can connect this printer, okay, USB cable goes here, just on top of the power cable, okay. Yeah, so the USB cable is in, okay, so it goes over here and this end goes to your co computer, okay, and the power cable is at the bottom. Okay, I take this off, it's by the way, what I'm going to show you is how to scan a document from this printer. You can scan a document, like I said, with USB cable, then you place your document here to scan right now. This printer is connected to wireless network, okay? So I have a document here I want us to scan, okay? A book that I want us to scan, okay? So you place your book here to the scanner and make sure you close this, okay, with a cover. The next thing to do is, is to go to your mobile device. Go to, you need to have, go to Play Store, from Play Store, then you go to Canon, Prints like inject selfie. This is where you connect this printer. Okay, printer status is complete. Okay, so what we need to do right now is basically to scan a document. Okay, so this printer is showing here TX5000 series is this printer. So to scan your document, you need to click scan. Okay, now from the scan, you change the setting, select the setting. JPG is a photo, so you need to change the format to PDF document. Okay, then document type. Okay, so document type we leave it to document, but if it's photo, you select photo. Okay, so it's right now on document. Then you select the color of document you want to print. If you want it color, you leave it to color. It's print right now on the color. If you want to print print gray, you select gray on your mobile device so that this print document will be printed out as a black okay and white right now i want us to go back to color okay now document size or platen you select the document size so you can select b5 a5 2l portrait 2l landscape hagaki portrait hagaki landscape 4x6 okay 4x6 landscape 4x6 portrait l portrait l landscape and card or even letter so you just need to select what paper document you have at the back tray or the front casket what we have here if we check we loaded a4 paper okay so this paper here is a4 the same thing is a4 at the front cassette okay so we leave it to a4 okay if you want to select a5 then you tap a5 okay so we'll go back to a4 once you select that, then you go back. The next thing to do is click scan. Right now, it's connecting to the printer. It's communicating. It's telling us here from the screen, please wait momentarily. So it's right now scanning. Scanning the original.
here we go so this document is what we scan and on the mobile device you can see this is what we scan right now okay so if you want to scan another document you can do this let's say we we'll take this off or scan the other side okay to scan out the back place it on the scanner and close then go back to your mobile device okay select scan again so this will be page two So right now is two pages okay if you want to exit or if you want to scan another page for instance you put this document in okay and select scan again it will be three documents we scan what is doing right now is scanning Okay, so this is the third document. Okay, so click exit once you finish. Okay, then the scan result will be saved. Click OK. So this is the first one. Okay, one of three. Okay, now this is the second one. So you go back to the document to scan. If you can't find it, okay, you do the same thing, scan the document again, okay. So we place this document, it looks as we miss it, okay, click scan. Okay, so click exit. Okay, click OK. Right now, this document to print it out or to share, you select information here. Okay, to print it out or to share, you select share. Okay, so if you want to print it out, you select print. What right now is processing. Okay, so you click next. This is to print it out. Okay. If you want to change any of the settings for the printer, you can select. Okay. So you select changing, copy. Okay. Now print with the paper that is set up on your printer. Click OK. Okay. Then you go back. Click print. Okay, paper source. Then you select the source of paper either from the bottom casket or the front. Okay, the top. The following paper information is set. The printer, please select on which you want to print. Okay. Right now, it's printing out this document we scanned.
okay nice and beautiful this is what we scan and printed out it will tell you on a mobile device printer start to printing is complete click ok okay the other thing to do if you want to to share this document with just scan okay you go back where the document is and share it to whoever you want to send it maybe to your email or to your friends or to relative okay thank you very much